Hello and welcome to whiskey.com where fine spirits meet. And today I have another, yeah, teaser for you, but you probably can't reach it because it is a German exclusive or whiskey.de exclusive. Yeah, the sister company from whiskey.com is whiskey.de, our store, and we have a club which is a uh, uh, five percent in our store and you get this club bottling and the club membership costs 60 euros and yeah we now have a bit of a problem because our club bottling yeah our stock is coming to an end and we can't get more of it so we already reordered but the stock is now gone so we are bringing out another club bottling from a different distillery and we chose the Tullibardin Triple Wood. They are, there are some other bottlings out there. This is kind of a, a series from Tullibardin the Murray. And we have now here a Triple Wood and the Triple Wood is from Moscatel, Whiteport and Sautern Casks. And that is just, yeah, that is a very, very nice mixture mixture. I can tell you the Tullibardin Murray um, are nice bottlings. They are top quality, but they are different in taste. If you find a Murray out there on the market and it's a different Murray, you have a lot of different casks in it and you will come to a, yeah, a very different flavor there. The core might be the same as it will be uh, this little bit from Tullibardin but uh, the yeah the fin or the, the the cast maturation will be different and you will have a lot of different influences in the whiskey mm. this one out comes out very soft malty fresh fruity with pineapple a mm. little bit of a dried fruit note like raisin so it's a, a mixture between a little bit of a, a white wine going on and a dark sherry or dark wine. Very interesting, very nice. It's complex, it's interesting and nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. Hmm. Stronger than I expected. Okay, it's 44, 46% ABV, and it's it has a, a oomph to it. It has oak. It has um, spiciness to it. It has wine aromas. A lot of dark aromas. Almost none of the tropical fruits that I had in the nose. So it's more of all the dark notes. All the spicy notes I had in my nose that all end up in the taste mm. but I like it it's it's not too dark as it's a 2007 um, distillate so that should be then 13 years and I like it mm. Mm. nice bottling mm. So to give you, if you if you find one of these Murrays on the shelf, you should have a look at um, what they have been matured in, and there is a nice uh, page on whiskey.com that I've written. It's in production background type of casks, and in these type of casks, I list all the common type of casks that the whiskies have been matured in or are matured in and what kind of influence it has on the whiskey. And if you find yourself within the influence of the whiskies that are the casks that are on the, the bottle written, then this bottle might be uh, interesting for you. So have a look at this page, see how different um, maturations in different casks vary the whiskey and then you can find out if the different Tullibardin, the Murray bottlings out there are something for you. Yeah, that was it. Thank you very much for watching and see you next time.